What's going on guys? Jabron here from Photographers on YouTube and today I'm going to show you how to clean, how to manually clean your DSLR image sensor. Right now you can't see the sensor because it's hidden behind this mirror uh, but I'm going to show you in a minute how to do this. Alright, so first thing you're going to need is a cleaning kit, okay? Uh, the kit that you see on your screen is sold on Amazon. It's made by Goja. I have posted a link of two of their kits on my website under discount equipment. So um, if you're interested, just go there and pick the kit that you want. The one you're seeing on the screen does not come with the uh, liquid, the cleaning liquid. And the reason why is because I already had the cleaning liquid. It's the same liquid I use to clean my eyeglasses. So if you have that liquid, just buy the one with the empty bottle. If you don't have it, then there's another kit they sell for like 13 bucks or 14 bucks, um, and you can get that. We're not going to use all the items to clean the DSLR, but when I do the second part of this video where I demonstrate how to clean the lenses, that's when that's when we're going to end up using, you know, the 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 pen and the microfiber cloth and and all that stuff, and and even blower um, as well. All right, so. Um, first thing you want to do is uh, to lock up the mirror to clean your sensor is make sure your battery is fully charged. If the battery is not charged, the camera will not allow you to lock up the mirror. So the battery has to be at least 75% charged. Okay. Uh, first thing is you want to, as soon as you spot a, 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 you know, spot dust on your picture that means your se your sensor is dirty now if you are seeing dust in your viewfinder and it's not showing up in your pictures that means the dust is is either here on top or the dust is on your mirror so then it will just show in your viewfinder but it's not going to be um, in your picture so you're fine if you if that bothers you you can you can clean this and I'll I'll I'll, I'll show you the process how it's done you basically just use this uh, rocket blower. Okay, so if the dust is on your sensor, what you want to do is, is this focus? All right, good. All right, so turn on the camera. Let me adjust the exposure so you can read. All right, so here it says clean. I don't know if you can read this clear, clearly. Okay, clean image sensor. Okay, so my Canon friends, just look for this option in menu, and most cameras have this built in. It says clean now, click OK. And it will tell you cleaning image sensor. Done. Now sometimes this will remove the dust from your image sensor. Sometimes the dust spot is kind of big or stubborn and it doesn't go away. So in a case like that, uh, you have to, let me adjust the exposure, you have to lock up this mirror. This mirror will go up and then you can see the sensor and then you will basically just blow uh, the air using the air rocket okay so menu just exposure okay so here it says lock mirror up for for cleaning okay so press this button and it will say start when you press start it will give you instruction and it says when shutter release button is pressed the mirror lifts and shutter opens and to turn off to lower the mirror just turn off the camera so this is how it's done watch here's your shutter release button let me fix the exposure so as soon as you press this this is gonna go up oh, I had lost the okay now it's gonna do it sorry guys there you go. So now what you see, it's kind of dark, but here, let me adjust it. The thing inside that you see is your mirror, uh, your sensor. Mirror is basically lifted up, and now you're basically going to blow uh, the air in there, and I'll show you in a second how it's done. All right, so right now I'm blowing air in the camera to to blow any dust um, that's in there, I like to hold my camera upside down so whatever that's whatever dust that I'm blowing basically just falls down. You know, if you do it the other way, uh, 
sure, you know, the dust is going to blow, but there's a good chance it may fall back onto your mirror or onto your sensor. Now, the process to, to clean your sensor is identical. This is exactly how you hold the camera upside down and blow air inside. Um, the only difference is that you have to lock up your mirror to do that. Um, real quick, guys, when you are blowing air onto your mirror, sometimes uh, the dust does not come off. It could be, a, it, it may just stick to your mirror or even the top part. So what you want to do is take a Q-tip, okay? Make sure your hands are clean. Wash your hands because you don't want any oil on, on, on your fingers. So roll this up a little, okay? And all you have to do is just touch. You can see the dust spot. Um, that's not, you know, uh, going away. Just touch it with the tip and it will, it will pick up the dust. Now, please don't do this with your image sensor. Don't touch with anything. I know there's some uh, tutorials out there. They're using um, these brushes to, to dust off the actual image sensor. I would not do this. You spend a lot of money on, on this equipment. Don't take a chance. There's Sometimes you could um, have oil on your sensor as well. And there's a, a wet kit people use. I would personally not take a chance and mess with my sensor. I would not even use the Q-tip. Um, you know, just uh, get in touch with a, a professional from either an Icon, Canon, or Sony, whatever camera you're using, and have them clean it. But I've never had any issues where I was not able to remove the dust. Um, so, you know, in, in most cases, this rocket will basically uh, do the trick. Worst case scenario, if there's a dust spot on the mirror. And it has happened to me a couple of times where I just used the Q-tip and um, I was able to clean that spot um, with no problem. All right, so hope all is well. I'm going to do a second video where I'm going to show you guys how to clean the lenses. Um, if you guys like my video, please give it a thumbs up and make sure you share this with your friends and family on Facebook or Twitter. All right, hope all is well and I'll talk to you guys later.